Let's talk about remote access scams, where criminals gain access to your device. Did you know that over 80% of ID care clients have experienced identity misuse following a remote access scam? Similar to gaining the keys to your house, it enables the criminals full access to your device and its contents. It also provides visibility to any login details and passwords you may enter whilst the criminal has access to your device. These scams often originate from other common scams, including phishing, investment fraud, and funds recovery scams. Some red flags to be on the lookout for include someone contacting you and claiming to be from a trusted organisation and pressuring you to download remote access applications like AnyDesk, Quick Support, or Team Viewer. They may say they need access to your device in order to step you through a process or troubleshoot a problem. This might include addressing a security concern on your device or with your bank accounts, or coaching you through establishing an online investment platform account, or to conduct a diagnostic test remotely. They may incite concern about an issue that is impacting you as a strategy to coerce a response and gain access to your device. Criminals often use your personal information to build legitimacy and they also rely on the off chance that you are having an in-the-moment interaction with the organisation they are impersonating. The most common organisations criminals impersonate includes telcos, banks, internet service providers, streaming and IT services. So how can you protect yourself? Firstly, if anyone contacts you requesting access to your device, be very wary. Hang up and contact the organisation via a way that you know is correct. The best, most secure way to do this is one, by logging into your account via the secure app that you have downloaded from the App Store, two, logging into your account online, or three, contacting the organisation via a phone number that you know is correct. Also remember that no legitimate organisation will ever pressure you to provide or confirm your passwords or one-time verification codes sent via SMS or email. What should you do if you suspect you've encountered a remote access scam? Always disconnect your device from the internet immediately. If you are connected to your home Wi-Fi, turn the modem off at the wall to cut off unauthorised access. If you provided access to your device or shared your personal information or identity credentials, contact ID Care and one of our expert case managers can provide you step-by-step -step guidance on what you need to do.